<coughs> a tight turnaround from the solid old game for the long trip to file tomorrow. Just uh, what are your thoughts going into this one? Uh, thoughts on Saturday, on reflection, was I thought we played well on the day, um, considering you know, we was up against a difficult opponent, massive budget, you know, favourites to win the league at the start of the season and um, difficult, difficult team to play against. I thought we was in control of the game. Um, just lacked that little finishing touch in front of goal. Obviously, their keeper had a good game for them. Um, and if we'd, have, if, if we'd have got the goal that I felt we deserved on the day and won the game, it would have been... It would have been well deserved, but you know, as it turns out, what's pleasing is after two disappointing performances and conceding goals, we've got a clean sheet and and the performance level was acceptable again. So um, we take the encouragement from that going into the uh, another difficult game tomorrow night. Obviously, you got the defensive response that you wanted from the two previous away games where we obviously conceded those goals. Um, is it now tomorrow night? Just hopefully getting that stroke of luck or getting the ball into the back and then hopefully getting three points. Yeah, I'm not sure it'll come down to luck. I know sometimes that can play a part, but we've got to, we've got to provide better quality in the final third, whether it be from the final pass or the final cross, final shot. Uh, we've just got to be a little bit better in front of goal that will see us get a goal and maintain the defensive qualities that we showed on Saturday and it, that... that that's not just the, the back three and, and obviously Lochi, that's everyone. Everyone has got to contribute both going forwards and defending. So uh, a little bit more quality in the final third and our defensive organisation being on point again. Uh, do you think obviously getting a point on Saturdays helped boost the boys' confidence from the two previous games and are you hoping they'd be able to bring that into tomorrow night? Yeah, I hope so. I mean... Uh, the, the way I like to coach and manage these boys, that they're, they're entitled to their opinion, and I asked them their beliefs on the game after after Saturday, and they were they were happy with how they played, and obviously spoke about as we've discussed now about ways of making it better. Um, but what we need to do is just maintain that sort of performance level and just add some quality in the final third which we've already proven this season that we've got that it's just about being consistent we've had a little blip a uh, little bit of character shown in, in bouncing back against a difficult side Saturday but it's about kicking on again now obviously Farl have won their two previous home games against Eastleigh and Wrexham respectively what kind of game are you expecting from them? Oh listen they're, uh, they're one of my they're one of the better sides in the league for me, in my opinion. Um, and what they've done is turned the corner after a, a difficult start to their season. I think they've had a, one or two new faces come in and one or two go out the door. So they've taken time to adjust. But, you know, I expect them with, you know, their manager's a great guy, a good football man as well. And I think they're a, a decent club with, with a decent team. So it be a very difficult game, always is up there. Um, but what we've got to do is look of ways to improve but at minimum continue our performance levels that we, we, we got back on track with on Saturday. And how's the squad looking fitness wise because not giving too much away? Um, any knocks on the weekend? No, we come through with a clean bill on, on Saturday which was pleasing. Um, may have one extra body back for tomorrow which is good and then potentially going into next Saturday could have another body back then so slowly but surely things will start to improve the more the more I have the group to select from um, but certainly I'll have the team and the and the subs from Saturday plus one more which is which I'm, I'm hoping will be enough on the day to get us three points and just lastly how key could a win be to getting a positive feel good factor around the place going into two massive home games yeah, we all want to win. I'm I, I'm as desperate as anyone. I've I've been hurt in the last. Uh, I, I was hurt in last couple of games, like everyone else. Um, and uh, I get as frustrated as anyone because I'm a fan, an ex-player, and, and and now in charge of this group of players. So I get frustrated. I want to win like everyone else. Um, so I'm going to get behind the boys tomorrow night, and hopefully we can go there and come away with three points.